Korea, it's guy. fun. Yeah. Here we are. <laughs> you like it here? It's awesome, right? It's like the little things. There's a woman in the lift line, and her only job is to. It's she's like, she's wearing the duck like a hat that's a duck, and she just does this. Yeah. That's it. It's that's all it. her whole job. It's like, oh hello. <laughs> I'm Sean White, I'm uh, a professional snowboarder here in um, Korea at the uh, Olympic Halfpipe and uh, it's a great sunny day and things are good. It was good, I mean to be honest like getting here and seeing the sun and the walls are soft <laughs> and it's definitely not intimidating at all but the pipe itself truly it's, it's great you know um, the flat bottom's really smooth, the walls are big, it just feels you know, comfortable and you can go as fast as you want or you can kind of like adjust, I don't know, however you're feeling, but I uh, I really didn't enjoy it. It's probably one of the best pipes of the season, for oh, sure, wow. hands it's down, good. yeah. Good. Which, thank God, <laughs> right? <laughs> this is that perfect scenario of like, good weather, good half pipe, and, and something about like, being with all the other competitors is, I love it, you yeah. know? Yeah, Cause it's like, you feed off everyone else and you do, I want them to know what tricks I could do. <laughs> you know what I mean? I should, it's like, it's good. It's just like a good energy. And, um, but you know, honestly, from, from Sochi not being so great to, uh, to coming here and it's one of the best pipes I've ridden in a long time. So I'm very happy. I was like walking home just like, so happy. yeah. And the fact that the Olympics will have a great half pipe is so, so nice. And, uh, <laughs> so nice. It would be so yeah. nice. Yeah. I was trying to, I was trying to time it, and I was like, ah, I'm not gonna. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is Madonna. Uh, it was it's in my head. Yeah. yeah. Every time I get on the mountain, I feel just as, you know, I just I want to win just as badly as before. I'm a competitor, you know, and and I will be honest. I've found times where it's hard to motivate. It is very difficult, and so for me, I always do skateboarding or music or something anything to or organizing crazy take, events. yeah to, uh, yeah Aaron style <laughs> that's, exactly that's, yeah, that's amazing event that's you know but it takes me away and takes my attention and it's you know it's challenging it's everything and then I come back to snowboarding and it's a, a nice relief you know it's a kind of like uh, living in two worlds but it's so nice to come back and feel excited about so it you and really you still really have fun oh yeah today yeah, was great nice. I haven't ridden and three hours I don't ride that long every day I, I like I went from the beginning of this the practice to the end like I'm, I'm having a good time today you know but in some days no you know but but no honestly it's anything anything it's a it's an ebb and flow of life and uh, you got to know when you're motivated and you got to realize when you're not and you got to take a step away so I've always said that my my biggest um, you know, thing that's kept me going this long is the fact that I take time away from the sport. You know, I, I live in California at the beach. I like, <laughs> it's the last thing I think about is snowboarding and then I come back and I'm like, oh, it's oh, that, not so bad, it's fun, yeah. yeah. So that's kind of been my secret over this <laughs> yeah. time, yeah. And that's why I'm excited to be here. Just like, I feel like my old into, self, into so. Yeah, I just feel like me again, so. <laughs> right, It'll be good, fun, right on. Yourself. Thank Thanks, you very much man. again. Cheers. Thanks, Till next time. <laughs>